My highlights, the biggest highlight. My highlight, highlights. The highlight. Hi everyone, um, my name is Angela Delfova and my highlight so far had to have been um, when Rihanna from the UK gave us an activity to go into groups, come up with a story, come back and share and then we all had to choose another group's story and so we had to change the ending and I personally believe that that really set the tone for the talk about climate change where the story is already out there but how can us as individuals change this narrative. Hi everybody, my name is Olivia and I think the biggest highlight for me was the fact that we could come together in the state of COVID-19. The fact that we could exchange ideas and, and talk about new things where we're not with each other was a massive highlight. So to everybody who was part of this, thank you so much for the opportunity and thank you so much for just sharing your heart and your view on this climate change. Thank you. Hi everyone, I'm Rochelle Ngalula Mukendi. These past months brought about artistic ways to portray the message of climate change. And for me, that was so beautiful because we could bring in recyclable material through our craft work to portray that message of climate change. And that was so much fun and so cool. Hey guys, my name is Jesse Jack. And what inspired me was Vincent's video about climate change and his perspective of the topic. What I liked is because he used videography and humor in a combination to bring about the awareness of climate change and not just use his generation into perspective but also the generation of old. Thank you very much Vincent. Hello everybody, I'm Nicole and my highlight was definitely when Becky Temba um, did the session and he shared about how he was educating his students on climate change and their expression of this was that they started a community garden that definitely inspired me to look around and see what I can do for my community for those close around me and I'm planning to start a garden first for myself to see what I'm able to do and then for the community and the next generation. Sunny Bonani, I am Nalutando Shandu and just to go off of Nicole's um, highlights with the garden, I also love the idea of how they created the garden in the school and they literally brought it close to the students and you know it's, it's, it's make it more practical for them about this climate change so that was really something that's so good and it stood out for me. Thank you. Hi everyone, so um, the highlight for me for this whole project was to see whatever I came up with with the little information that we got from the previous week like the whether it was a PowerPoint presentation or a poster or whether it was just something entertaining to do just to bring the vibes you know it was so nice for everyone to come together and work to get the whole point across of what climate change really is. So my highlight was when I think it was South Roots came together and they did this really like um, drama with a uh, dance and it was a growing of the tree and I thought it was like a really important piece of um, drama and exciting because they kind of showed us about like growing from the seed to a tree and then the tree getting burned down and I think that's my highlight because I never thought about doing something the way they did it by combining drama and music and it was exciting. What action did it inspire in you to make social change? So uh, one of the actions that it inspired me was to just be really careful of what I'm recycling, making sure that I'm recycling, but also telling the young people what to recycle. And I think we've come together and um, me and a young person in the future are going to get a bunch of crisp packets together and then iron them up and then so you can have a bag for homeless people so they can keep warm during winter. For me, it was finally seeing people because it was during lockdown and I was staying by myself and I was just so happy to be interacting with people, even if it was online. It was worth it. It was the improv for me when we had to go into our little sections and, you know, put up a small presentation or a play. That was actually good. It was the improv acting for me. It was the innovative ideas for me. The one that Rochelle, Nolutando, Angela and Tombi did. My favorite thing about the project was getting to learn with so many people from all around the world, something I've never done before. And another thing that I really enjoyed was actually hearing how many people don't know too much about climate change. This is one of my favorite things because 
it shows that people are still willing and wanting to make a change without ha actually having too much information on it. It just shows that there, there is hope because if there was more things out there, then maybe we can really make a change. And something that I'm going to do different moving forward is I'm going to share all of the information that I've learned on the project with everybody to all the people I know and hopefully they can tell a friend to tell a friend and we can make the world a better place. Being involved in the Climate Change Project has been something totally amazing. It has allowed me to educate myself around the issues of climate change and how it has affected our world and how it will continue to affect should we not stand now and make a difference. My highlight to being involved in this project was the fact that I've got an opportunity to meet so many young people around the globe and how they also want to bring about change and also sharing our ideas and how we can bring about change and how we can contribute positively in making a difference in this climate change project. Hello, my name's Heather. Um, I took part in the Indra project. Um, it was beautiful to see people from different corners of the globe coming together in the virtual realm, sharing ideas, creative ways of communicating those ideas and entering into discussions about social change and environmental issues that are affecting us globally. It was interesting to hear how certain issues affect different countries in subtly different ways. Um, the highlight I have to say, it actually shared with uh, Rihanna, who was on the Manchester project with me, um, was the dance piece where we watched um, the cycle of a life of a tree from seed to sapling to fully grown mature tree. Um, it was a piece that got us all involved off our chairs, involved in the dance movement. And I don't do a lot of dance, so it was quite nice that we could all come together like that and a lot of energy um, and beautifully illustrated piece. And um, what action did it inspire? in me to make for social change. Um, sowing some wild seeds, so collecting seeds pods um, and sowing them in areas, um, trying to help to boost the wildlife in our local area, um, promoting um, innovative ideas for reducing waste, recycling, upcycling of clothes to try and reduce the impact of fast fashion. <laughs> I'm not the one that breaks my